Nice way to finish this off, Coach. Yeah, I think it was nice. Like, uh, you know, I thought we played really well for two periods. We, you know, kept them in check pretty good. And, uh, you know, we played like four lines and uh, I thought we did a good job. In the third period, they came on. Our goalie was, was the difference, made some big save. And, uh, yeah, it's great to finish, I think, with a win for the guys. This time of year, back-to-back -back games are always more, a little bit more difficult. Makes it even more difficult when you lose a top defenseman after 20 minutes of play. And then for a good chunk of the third, Chikrin goes down. Yeah, I think we were short uh, manpower on the D, but uh, I thought the four guys that were left played uh, extremely well. And, and our forward, like I said, for two pairs, I think our forwards really did a good job. Uh, keeping the puck ahead of us and uh, defending, you know, I think so. That was the difference. Any update on Thomas? Uh, no, I think it just uh, we'll see or reevaluate when we get home. Upper body. Yuri Smekel gets his first NHL goal tonight. How uh, how nice was that to see? Well, it's nice for him because I thought that since he's been back up, I thought he's played pretty well for us. So I think it's it's nice for for him to finish the. Uh, the last game with a goal, and uh, I think it's, you know, gives him some some confidence. I think he, he did a good job playing, whether he was playing wing or center. Uh, I thought uh, he was good. Not sure if you had, have had time to digest it yet, but when you look at the team and how they've progressed since you've taken over, have you seen a growth in their maturity, especially over the last few games? Yeah, I, you know, I think there's been some growth, but there's still some, you know, lots of work to to, to be done, but. I think there's a good uh, good nucleus there. Um, I think you just need a little more uh, experience, you know, to to blend with those with those young guys. I think uh, that'll be uh, you know a, a major factor. And um, but I, I hope that next year, you know, you could start like uh, on the right foot with uh, good habits and uh, be able to uh, make a step in the right direction. I guess, in your opinion, the focus on results or the focus on the process is over with a solid end result? Yeah, it was, uh, yeah, I think uh, the fact that, uh, you know, we played pretty well today, the last, actually the last couple of weeks, you know, on the road, I thought we've had some good games, even the game that we lost, 2-0 uh, in, in Florida, I thought, you know, we worked hard and we competed, uh, you know, even the Rangers last night, you know, they're number one team in the league, and uh, so I, I think we're, the team's going in the right direction, so we just got to continue. Well, how good does this feel here, the victory and the personal accomplishment? <laughs> yeah, uh, I said it after after the second that if we win, it's going to be special, and and it is. So, yeah, great feeling. In your 20th game here in the last game of the regular season, you get your first in the NHL. And uh, I said to Brady earlier that most of these games that we've seen you in, you've had a smile on your face here, and obviously a little bit bigger one here tonight. Yeah, of course. I think I was... Uh, close few times but uh, today when I saw Brandon crossing the line I, I knew he's gonna find me there so I was expecting that and then I found that little hole and it went in so great feeling. Was there any anxious moment uh, knowing that it was being reviewed by the officials? Yeah like <clears throat> I, I thought I saw it like yeah. all the way behind but then I saw referees say like no I was like no oh my god <laughs> then he was like reviewing that I was like praying that it's, it was in and it was in so great feeling. Is uh, the way the team played over the last few games tonight included kind of the perfect way to head into the off season here? A little momentum. Yeah, I feel especially today. I think that I can say I think they weren't ready for us. I think we surprised them how well we played after even after first period it was like 11-3 on shots. So yeah, I think we we played a great game. They actually were like good in the third. They had some chances, but Forzi played phenomenal today. And uh, how you say great great way to finish the season chance to take a peek at your phone and see if it's blown up or not yeah it friends does. and family and yeah. yeah a lot of congrats well congratulations thank you had to rattle the cage here a little bit to we'll rattle the tank to get everything out of this one tonight yeah um i mean we knew we knew we was gonna they were gonna come out uh come out hard in the in the third period um obviously uh we battled hard too to get two points here, um, we 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 get a we get to remember remember this going into next year that you just get through these situations and uh, um, you just play tight, and try to play as uh, tight as possible. That this this is going to happen, and uh, and just as a team you have to deal with it. And uh, today today we we ended up getting two points even though the situation. 
as a team that you know, obviously you go through a season where you, you you didn't meet expectations and disappointing season for everybody involved, even personally, I'm guessing. Um, is this something that you, from this result, hold on to to get you through those summer months? Yeah, I mean, obviously, um, both uh, team ways and and personally, uh, it's been a frustrating season, a lot of ups and downs, uh, you know, consistency. Um, going into next year, I've got to bring the the good feeling that I had out there today, and uh, hopefully um, the team can do the same thing and uh, remember remember games like these where uh, we're beating the best teams in the league and uh, and know that we can do it. Uh, Yuri Smekel gets his first goal of his career tonight. Uh, how's that feel as a team to see that? Um, it's awesome. Uh, he fights hard every game out there. Uh, and this great guy uh, works hard, and uh, it's it's always fun to see the guy who scores first in a shell goal. And uh, Jacques Martin, likely coaches last game as the interim head coach. Just what has he meant to this group? Uh, I mean, ever since he came in, it kind of calmed down the group a little bit, and I uh, got some uh, um, got some experience, uh, obviously, and uh, brought that into to the room, um, and uh, appreciate a lot done for us, um, and. Uh, yeah, I think a lot of guys have learned learn a lot from him and in Alf as well. Um, and uh, we just got to bring that with us. How much more difficult is it when you lose a defenseman after one period of play and then lose a second defenseman for a good chunk of the third? Uh, obviously not ideal, but we have uh, we have good defensemen. They're in good good shape, so they uh, they have no problem dealing with that. What a nice way to finish. Uh, yeah, it's um, to finish on a positive note after, you know, the year we had, it's, um, you know, it's definitely nice, definitely, you know, feel a little bit better about yourself going into the summer, but, um, I mean, we're not winning that game for, for Forzy and the big saves that he made in the third period. Yeah, obviously the third was um, critical, and uh, he just seemed to elevate his game at the right time. Yeah, he was awesome. He stood on his head, and uh, like you said, he made that big save at the right time. So, um, yeah, no, it's... Um, no, it must be, you know, no, feel good for him to kind of go in the summer like that. And, and uh, you know, for the whole group, uh, um, you know, to grind out that, you know, back to back to you know, finish off the year. It's not an easy one. It's, yeah, you no, know, two teams that were top of the division to finish off the year. So uh, it wasn't an easy task, but, uh, no, I thought the group, um, um, you know, fought the fight tonight. In the 20 games that Yuri Smakel has played with your hockey team, um, I don't think that we've seen him without a s smile on his face yeah. here, and uh, for good reason tonight. Yeah, he was, uh, no, of course, he was fired up. It's, um, no, I mean, it's a, it was a big goal to kind of get the game going, and, and uh, you know, it was a you know, great shot, too. It's a, um, you know, sneaky five-hole shot that, um, you know, he had a lot of confidence and so um, yeah I'm happy for him the whole group's happy for him that's definitely uh, an amazing feeling uh, you know get a goal in the NHL not many people could say that so um, yeah we're all very happy for him. Do you feel the way the team finished out the season here the last few games tonight included that the foundation is set for what this team could be next year? Uh, I mean it's uh, you know for me personally it's going to take uh, you know a little bit of time to reflect and uh, um, you know kind of just regroup get the you know, mindset right for, you know, the hard work and uh, the summer workouts and, and uh, all that other stuff is, um, you know, have all the faith and, and trust and, you know, management, ownership and, and uh, whatever plans they have that, uh, you know, just going to try to be the best leader that I can and, um, with the group that we're going to have. So, um, yeah, for, for me this summer, it's all about uh, um, trying to knock off the, the distractions a little bit, just focus on myself and, and uh just make sure my game's ready to go for next year. Tonight was likely uh, Jacques Martin's last game as interim head coach. What has he meant to the group here? Hey, he's brought a lot of uh, no details to um, you know, our game, and for me individually, it's um, you know, I, I've kind of trying to find the, the best words to describe. But um, I was just trying to be a sponge when it came to you know, all aspects of my game. It's you know my defensive game is something I've always um, you know, wanted to work on and keep working on, and, and um, you know I want to. You know, be a reliable player defensively uh, for the next bunch of years. So he, he taught me a lot about that this year, and I just um, you know, just little details that I just need to keep working on.